Hello, everybody. Michael Anfield here, and thank you for joining me. Woo! Okay, so I have these shoes that I just washed recently in the washing machine, actually. So I did a really thorough job. And I just wanted to talk about uh, these shoes actually are or were new, totally brand new. But I got them in a thrift shop, so they looked brand new. And I just wanted to talk about minimalizing and uh, minimalizing, whatever, however you pronounce it, um, your shoes. So basically, these are one of my shoes. I have another pair of sandals I just got recently in the mail after a long time waiting for it in the, in the mail. But basically, um, I had only these shoes for a long time. And I had another sandals, but they were half broken. And then eventually they just fell apart. I gave it to a friend if he wanted to fix it. But otherwise, uh, I have these shoes that I got last year. And I use them for basically for everything. So it has holes in it. I still use it. It's working good. The soles are good. These are New Balance, Minimus, uh, and a Vibram sole, as you can see there. And these are still very good quality. The only thing is that some of this is falling apart. Otherwise, it's very good. It's still intact there you know only the material here is a little bit worn out as you can see some of these holes in the front there but otherwise everything is uh everything is good except these you know just a few little minor issues but i've used it for everything i've used it for walking hundreds of kilometers um i use them for working out in the garden i've used them for hiking in the mountains I've used them for basically for anything. Yeah, for everything and every anything. So just a few holes here. Um, I wish they used a thicker material, a little bit thicker, but I know it's a minimalist shoe. So I'm going to be keeping these as long as they still work. Okay, as long as they still work, I'm going to be using them as much as possible. I'm going to be fixing them as much as possible. And uh, I have my other sandals as well, which I'll be using from time to time. But uh, basically, I want to try and strive to walk barefoot. So I want to strive to walk barefoot. These are the other sandals I have for indoor because, unfortunately, the ground is cold. But uh, I'll be giving that to a friend. But uh, walking barefoot everywhere is the best thing that we can be we could be doing so be joyful and try to reuse as many times and many years as possible your shoes so i have basically two shoes one minimalist sandal shoe upstairs and these are my new balance um vibrams uh, that I got for three dollars in the thrift shop, three Canadian dollars, which is like one fifty or two dollars, maybe two dollars US. So it's like wow, incredible, three dollars. And that was last year I bought them. So it's almost, almost a year, maybe a year has gone by. And look at this, and it was used as well, but it was like brand new basically when I bought it. It was all yellow. Um, no paint on it. Everything was perfect. It was just brand new. I don't know why people, why the person just gave them to the thrift shop. But I'm glad they, they did because I'm utilizing it. And I really love these shoes. These are very minimal shoes. They really work great. I really am impressed with them. It's called New Balance Minimus. And it's Vibram Soul. So it's a very good shoe. I don't know if they sell it still, but if they do, it's a very good shoe. Um, again, I don't use it every single day, but I've used it a lot. I've used it hundreds, hundreds of kilometers. Um, I've hiked in it. I've walked in it. I use it in a mountain. I use it virtually everywhere. Um, 
And now I have also my sandals, as I said before. Uh, maybe we'll take a look at my sandals as well. Uh, maybe not. Okay, so these are the shoes. All I can say is that um, I try to wear all my stuff until it falls apart. I have sewn a lot of my clothes. I've sewn a lot of stuff. And I try not to buy whatever I, you know, I don't, if I don't need something, I try not to buy. So that's really about it for this video, everybody. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to uh, buy from the thrift shop whenever you possibly can. If you can, better yet, fix your products. Whatever you can fix, sew, whatever you can make work, do so. Because buying even from the thrift shop is something we really don't want to do. We want to try and minimize our um, buying and spending, okay? So spend as little as possible. Now, that's about it for this video. Give it a thumbs up. Share it around with all your friends and family if you found it useful. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and click that little bell icon for notifications in your email. And don't forget also that uh, you can subscribe to my email newsletter. Yes, it's all down below in the description. So don't forget to check that out, check the description out. And also don't forget to get my books because that's how I survive. That's how I continue making these videos. And I love you all. Take care, everybody.